Uh, we have since actually signed that declaration. I've talked to Governor Sanders about that. She's also talked to the president about that, as has been reported. And so we are well down the path of what it will take to uh, get to a presidential declaration for this disaster. Uh, speaking of Governor Sanders, she was here yesterday. Uh, we walked several neighborhoods. There was a contingent of our federal uh, delegation, Congressman Womack, uh, Senator Bozeman, and a number of others who saw the destruction firsthand, which was really important. Um, and our partnership with the state has been phenomenal since the moment this started. Uh, also, we've been communicating, collaborating with our cities. I was on a phone call about an hour and a half ago with all of the mayors uh, in Benton County and their staffs, updating them on what we're doing with regard to a couple of issues that I'll come back to in just a second. We've had excellent partnership with our federal delegation, particularly in the interaction with FEMA. FEMA is here now. They're in the assessment phase now. They're in the air, actually, I think, as we speak. And they will be on the ground assessing properties in person tomorrow, working with Adam and working with our emergency management staff. Um, so what I want to do today is I'm going to update on a couple things, and then we have a number of folks here. I'm going to turn it over to Sheriff Holloway and then some other folks that you can either ask questions of uh, or uh, who have a couple of statements. So I'll turn it over to Sean in just a minute, and as we have people come up, they'll introduce themselves. First thing is one of the key issues that uh, obviously is of concern is debris removal. Uh, we have not seen, uh, that I can recall, an incident that has created debris to the extent that we have now. We are working extensively on identifying locations to take debris, and right now we have five to seven sites. Some will be open to public, some will just be sites that we can utilize for municipal and county debris but we will shortly have updates on where the public can take debris and what we will do with debris that, that is in uh, various uh, neighborhoods and, and other locations. What we're uh, planning to do, at least in the county, and I know we've had a call with the cities and cities will, will, will do their thing as well, but we'll be able to pick up organic debris that's moved to the right of way. In other words, move it to the roadside, we'll be able to pick up organic debris, trees, limbs, things of that nature. And it's really important that citizens separate that from the other kind of debris. So 